So in today's video, we're going to be reviewing the AirUp bottle. I got the new U bundle, which includes the bottle and some flavors. I also bought an extra pack of cherry cola flavored pods and also bought one of these brushes to, to clean the straw. Um, so this is kind of an interesting product. How it works is the flavor is generated from smell. So you put these scented pods on the top um, and when you're drinking the water, you get like a flavor profile through smell. So I'm not sure how it works exactly. I think it's, I'm not paid for this review or anything. It's just a product I wanted to review. Um, the total cost of this bottle and the brush and the extra pods cost me about 50 pounds in total, which I think is very, very expensive for a water bottle and some flavors because you can get a water bottle for about five pounds. You can get some squeezable cordial flavors too for only a few pounds. So let's see if this is groundbreaking technology and let's see how this works. So again, I need to clarify that I'm not being paid for this review. I'm just doing an honest review because it's a product I wanted to try out. I kind of noticed, I kind of heard about this product the most from the KSI and Tommy Fury fight because it seemed like everybody was getting sponsored by AirUp. So let's, uh, let's see how this product works. So we're going to fill it up with water first. Um, it has like a silicone kind of cap at the top. Uh, there's a straw mechanism and then there's the plastic bottle. You can get these in metal or like stainless steel, I believe, which can help keep the drink cold. But I just went with the standard, standard version here. So we filled it up with water. I just gave the other components a little bit of a rinse. And let's just go back and assemble it. So there's this kind of teardrop shape on the straw. That's how you know you're aligning the straw into the cap at the right angle. And then that kind of sticks in. It doesn't really screw in. You just have to compress it into position. And then you screw the top part onto the bottom half of the bottle. So that, that's this kind of screw mechanism. Yeah, so we're pretty much good to go. I'm just going upstairs to get one of those pods. I did do like a spill test actually. And the water just comes straight out. There's no like way for the water to be blocked like in those Gatorade sports cups. So just bear that in mind to keep the lid on. There is a little bit of leakage even with the lid on, which is a little bit disappointing. So you'll see that when I take the lid off, there's some water which comes out from the side. So just something to bear in mind. I don't think it's 100% leak proof, even with the lid on, like water will go inside the lid and then when you uncap it, it may uh, kind of leak. So uh, let's try the cherry cola pods. So this is the first one I tried. I actually ordered some extra ones of these thinking this product would work quite well so let's let's give it a go so cherry cola i like that flavor profile which is why i ordered some extra ones so i hope it is going to be good each pod comes individually sealed and you just slot the pod in place. So you can see I did it wrong initially. It says this side down. So I flipped it upside down. Again, there's a teardrop shape. So you, you're going to be pressing it in, in in one angle. So you can't really get it wrong. I did notice it's not very sturdy. Like it's very springy, actually. I thought it would just click into place, but there, there is kind of like a bit of a springing kind of springy motion there anyway I, I was kind of curious to see how the scent translates it to the water because it seemed sealed to me but when I looked carefully I saw a small hole on this rubber area and there is a corresponding small hole on the flavor pod in the same area too so that's how the scent or the flavor gets through into the water <laughs> it 
So this is me trying it, and to be honest, I was pretty disappointed. Um, it seemed like there was some kind of hole in the straw, so you couldn't really get some good suction. Normally when you have a straw drink, you suck and you get like a mouthful of the juice or whatever that you're drinking. But in this case, it's like air is coming into your mouth, so you're never fully satisfied with the amount of liquid you get in your mouth. And I couldn't really taste much at all. It was like I was drinking water, but there was a smell of like cherry cola sweets, which I could just smell. So it for me, it didn't really affect the flavor profile of what I was drinking. There was just an aroma of cherry cola while I was drinking plain water. And it wasn't like they were merging together. It was just I was drinking water with the smell of cherry cola. And it wasn't really that strong as well. So I thought I would try out a different pod. Here is the mixed berry or the berry pod. And same thing again. It's like lots of air comes up through the straw. So you don't get a full mouthful of the liquid. And it's just, it's just missing something. Like I like drinking, if I'm having flavoured water, I like a strong flavour profile. And in this case, it's just so weak and it it's just not really worth it on that basis. Um, it's a weak flavour, um, so when you put the pod in, you barely get any kind of taste. You can still taste the plain water, but you just get a certain smell of whichever pod. But it's not strong enough where you can really feel a difference or taste a difference. Second thing, it's very expensive, £50, plus the pods for a, for a water bottle, I don't think is worth it, especially considering the fact that the pods are costly. It's probably cheaper to buy flavoured water than to buy the pods. And the fact that there is some kind of, there is air coming up through the straw means that it's a very unsatisfying draw of kind of liquid in the mouth it's hard work you're not getting as much liquid for the amount of sucking that you're doing so that's something else to consider let me know what you think of this air up water bottle if you have any feedback maybe i'm doing something wrong i'm happy to reconsider uh, considering now i own this bottle uh, but i don't think i'll get much use of it to be honest because i don't like this uh, this mechanism but let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions about it, leave a comment in the comment section below. And thank you very much for watching. I bet you most things are more expensive than just five pounds. Alright, review is done. Should we get you? Let's get